Okay, we're going to be putting a transmission in a 2005 Dodge Durango. I started with removing the battery post. Just took the negative off. So we're going to start down underneath. I'm going to remove this cover, which is these two bolts, a bolt here, and a bolt on the other side, right here. And then I will remove these two bolts inside here, and these eight bolts, these four, and these four. Okay, when I get to that, I will let you know the next step. Okay, got those bolts remo removed and those covers taken off. Now we're gonna start on these four driveline bolts. Four of them. And we're gonna remove these six bolts around the transfer case housing. So get those six out of there. And we're gonna remove these four driveline bolts up here in the front. When we get done with those, show you the next step. Okay. I now have the transfer case bolts out. The driveline bolts up there in the front. Uh, I did run a ratchet strap into the frame around that side of the torsion bar up around the transfer case over the exhaust and back down underneath and hooked it because you can wedge this transfer case back far enough to pull the transmission out without having to take the transfer case out and I got the driveline bolts out now I am going to work on the transmission brace here. It has uh, four bolts going into the to the engine and two going into the transmission right here. And when you take this cover off, you can get to the torque converter bolts, which there's four of those. And once I get those out, then I will work on the wiring harness on top of the engine on top of the transmission and the bell housing bolts so when i get to that i will return okay i have the bracket off the starter off the torque converter bolts out which you can't see the bracket i flipped down so I could get up to the torque converter bolts up there. I did have to take the racket pinion loose to flip the bracket. Uh, they are size 22. Now I'm going to remove the bolts around the bell housing and the wires and the transmission lines. If you haven't taken these off, there's this little plastic clip here you have to remove and then pull those little pins out and they'll come right out. No need to unscrew the bolt. Okay, can you let that down slowly or do I need to come up and do it quick? Slowly, otherwise you'll break my wires. There you go. Slow, slow, slow. Stop. Stop.
I need an eight. Just an eight socket. Uh, wrench or a little socket, that'll be fine. A uh, little socket or wrench. Uh, ratchet two to go with it. Thank you. Can you push the end back? Oh, sh can you let the jack down? No. Put it down. Down. I'm trying. Well, it was going down. Okay, stop. Oh, shit. Push it right there. Okay, hey, up. Up, 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 up. Up more. Okay, stop. Might have to go up just a little bit more so I can get that bolt all the way out. Keep going. One more. A little more. A little more. Oh, okay. Now can you let it down slowly? Alright, down it is. Here's the training fluid, you dump that in that bin.
Okay. Do me a favor and pull the jack out. Just grab it and just pull it out. Keep going. Okay, it is all the way out.